Welcome back to the channel. Look, you've read the title, so I'm not going to waste any of your time. This is how to buy Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. So I'm going to touch really quickly on one or two points about the asset class itself. Then I'm going to get into the platforms that I recommend you buy these assets on. And then we're going to do a live buying demo and buy a little bit of Bitcoin right here and now. So you may have heard about Bitcoin through the news media or social media about how it's reached this price or that price, or you may have heard about it from word of mouth by somebody saying they bought a little bit and they made money or they bought a little bit and it's a scam. Or you may have heard about a company like BlackRock, one of the largest institutions in the world, making a product based off of Bitcoin. But either way, it sparked your interest and now you're ready to buy some yourself. So before you invest in anything, whether it's cryptocurrency, stocks, real estate, starting a business, you're starting trading, you have to do your research. And if you want to learn specifically how to do research on cryptocurrencies, I've made a video about that. I'll drop the link below. So two points that I want to hit on quickly before we get into the demo is Bitcoin itself was created in 2008. So it's not that old. And we only really have price data from 2011. So we only have about 13 or 14 years of price data, which means it's a very, very young asset class compared to something like the s p 500 in which we've been tracking since 1871 so that's one point it's very very young very new uh, the other point is that it's a technology understand that you're investing in a technology and a software so bitcoin itself the number one cryptocurrency it, it inspired an entirely new wave of cryptocurrencies and other assets that you can purchase and possibly make money in and keep in mind none of this is financial advice so with that being said here are the two platforms that i recommend you begin on uh the first one is robin hood a very well established company very trusted company and they offer cryptocurrency uh buying as well like you can buy apple microsoft and cryptocurrencies like bitcoin on Robinhood. and the second one that i recommend is coinbase.com um this is where i buy the majority of my cryptocurrency coinbase so these are the two websites i'll drop the link below so let's get into the home pages for these websites so when it comes to coinbase this is what the home page looks like um you want to you're going to have to link it to either a credit card, a debit card, or your bank account uh, to, to purchase these cryptocurrencies. Uh, when it comes to Robinhood, you'll have to uh, link a debit, credit, or bank account and then put the money inside of Robinhood before you buy it. So this is a uh, Coinbase's homepage. So let, we're, we're gonna do the live demo from this website. So this is Coinbase. So they have the homepage with the first most popular cryptocurrencies, but let's go to trade. And here you'll be able to scroll through several of the top cryptocurrencies um then you'll be able to so yeah so scroll through several of these then you may be able to search a specific cryptocurrency that you're looking for or search via categories because there's several categories in this asset class but let's go with bitcoin itself so here's bitcoin currently sitting at thirty nine thousand seven hundred and eleven dollars and the price changes constantly and it's updated live like you see it just changed again so uh here's the token that you're buying here's how much you have to spend on it they'll give you a limit they're not going to let you buy as much as you want so let's say we buy let's make it a one-time order in the buy category and let's buy 50 dollars worth of bitcoin so after you click how much you want to they have preset notions but you can actually put anything let's put 25 dollars, and you can go to preview buy and here it'll show you where you're paying from how much uh, the current price of Bitcoin is and it's updated constantly. So even when it's on this page, it's not locked in. It's not locked in until you buy uh, the, the total purchase of how much Bitcoin you'll have, the total fee. So however much you put, they'll subtract their fee from it. And that's how much of the asset that you will get. So I said $25. Their fee is $1.49 per trade. So let's go ahead and buy it may take a second it may not go through instantly because that's how markets works they don't just work like that but the order was submitted and within five or ten seconds i will have that bitcoin so uh if we want to do the same thing on Robinhood, this is Robinhood's homepage. you'll go to crypto 
Uh, they'll have the top list of cryptocurrencies, just like Coinbase. And let's click on Bitcoin and you'll have how much money you have already funded in your account down here. And then you'll just type in again, let's say $50 worth of Bitcoin. And they'll have the buy preview here. Uh, the spread, how much Bitcoin you'll probably get. It changes by the second. It's live updated. And then you review your order. So that's how you buy Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. In the next video, we'll get into how you store Bitcoin and cryptocurrency. So I appreciate y'all for rocking with me. If you got any value out of this, drop a subscribe, drop a like, and leave a comment. I'm going to holler at y'all.